Hey, what is going on? This is Rob from Panther, and today we're going to check it out some sacred geometry, which is inspired from the Flower of Life. First step, make sure that you're on the stroke. I'm going to click on the stroke. I'm going to select the black color, and I'm going to select the circle ellipse tool. Press and hold Shift plus Alt, create a circle. I'm going to press and hold Alt, drag it down until they intersect right here. Select both, right click group. I'm going to select the rotate tool, double click on the rotate tool. I'm going to type in 60 degrees, click on copy and then press control D. Now we got a flower going on. Select all right click group. I'm going to press and hold shift plus alt, scale it down. Select it, go to object, go to pattern, make. So from here, make sure to select the tile type from grid to brick by column. And we're going to work first with the height. So let's decrease the height distance and this intersection must connect with this intersection. So I'm going to decrease it until they start connecting. There you go. Now I connect it and I'm going to decrease the width distance until these two circles going to, you know, this intersection, this little intersection going to connect with this intersection. So let's see what happens. There you go. Should be somewhere around here. I'm going to, Go up to the left, click on done. I'm going to delete the flower and I'm going to go select the rectangle. From here, make sure to swap from stroke to fill. So I swapped it and click on the fill to be on the top. Now go to the swatches and here, as you can see, we got a new pattern. Click on the pattern and just make a rectangle. And this is how you make the pattern. Thank you so much for watching and if you're new on the channel, don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you get notified with daily updates and also check out the rest of the videos at the end. Have a good one. Bye bye.